Steve Rubio Namaka. I'm happy to welcome you all for our online teaching academy, Ekalaiva. Class 10, Subject Biology, Unit 16, Plant and Animal Hormones. Introduction The word hormone is derived from Greek word hormone that means to excite. The meaning of the hormone is to excite. Excitement. It provides something. It gives some something that is called excite. We became happiness. That is called excite. So the function on the function of Control and coordination in plants is performed by chemical substances produced by the plants are called plant hormones. Once again, I am repeating the function of control and coordination in plants is performed by chemical substances. The chemical substances are produced in the plant itself. So, the function of control and coordination of plants is performed by chemical substances produced by the plants called plant hormones. See here, think that it is a plant. In that plant, uh, the functions and coordination in plants is performed by the chemical substance which is released in the plants. That is called plant hormone. In plants, several cells are capable of producing hormones. These phytohormones, phytohormones is nothing but plant hormones. The hormones which is produced in the plants are called plant hormones or phytohormones are transported to different parts of the plant to perform the vital various physiological functions. I am repeating once again. These phytohormones, phytohormones is nothing but plant hormones are transported to the different parts of the plant to perform various physiological functions. The next one is endocrine glands in vertebrate animals. Vertebrate animals is nothing but the animals which are having the backbone, notochord. So endocrine glands in vertebrate animals possesses a diversified, diversified communication system, diversified communication system, the large communication system. This system coordinate physiological and metabolical functions by releasing a chemical integration that is called hormones. I am repeating, endocrine glands in vertebrate animals possesses a diversified communication system diversified this system coordinates physiological and metabolic functions by chemical integrations the endocrine system you know uh, 10 different organ system in our body one among them is endocrine system the endocrine system acts through chemical messages chemical messengers known as hormones. Hormones are the chemical messengers which produced by specialized glands which is in the in the body. There are so many glands in the body. The first one is pituitary gland. It is present in the skull. And then second one is thyroid gland. It is present in the neck region. And then this is pancreas. It is present in the abdomen. And then adrenal gland, it is situated on the anterior part of the kidney. The next one is testis and ovaries. So these are all present in the uh, pelvic region. So these are all the glands. Each gland synthesized hormones. Hormones are the chemical messengers. Okay. So endocrine system acts through chemical messengers known as hormones which produced by specialized glands in the body. Physiological processes such as digestion, metabolism, growth, development 
and reproduction are controlled by hormones all the chemical reactions all the metabolic reactions physiological processes that means metabolic reactions growth development and reproductions are controlled by hormones next we move on to plant hormone plant hormones are organic molecules organic molecules is nothing but made up of carbon hydrogen and oxygen carbon hydrogen oxygen so plant hormones are made up of organic molecules that produced at extremely low quantity low concentration in plants these molecules what molecules organic molecules control morphological physiological and biochemical responses morphological response is nothing but physical appearance growth and then physiological response physiological functions means so many uh, functions metabolic functions and then biochemical reactions so all these morphological physiological and biochemical responses are controlled by the hormones again i am repeating the organic molecules that is called the plant hormones plant hormones are organic molecules the organic molecules control by morphological physiological and biological responses see here the plant produce a fruit and all this uh, fruit production growth of the plants all these are controlled by the plant hormones the plant hormones are organic molecules that means it is the hormones are made up of carbon hydrogen and oxygen types of plant hormones there are five major classes of plant hormone they are the first one auxins second one cytokinins third one gibberellins fourth one abscisic acid and the last one is ethylene so there are five different classes of plant hormones the number one first one is auxins second one cytokinins third one gibberellins fourth one abscisic acid and the last one is ethylene among the five plant hormones the first three auxins cytokinins and gibberellins promote the plant growth these three hormones auxins cytokinins and gibberellins promotes the plant growth while the abscisic acid and ethylene inhibit the plant growth clear so the last two abscisic acid aba and the ethylene inhibit the plant growth see the elongation of stem the growth of the plant is controlled by gibberellin and then initiation of flowering growth of the formation of fruits growth of the plants all these are controlled by auxin gibberellin and cytokinin the growth of the young bud that also mainly due to auxins here the hormonal interaction in plant growth and development thank you children uh, we will see in the next class